Hey. Hey. Should you be up there? Yeah, the realtor said we'd get a better price if the roof was in good shape. I'm just taking a look. Yeah, but a man your age and size. Did you come out here to insult me? Mom sent me out here to help. The insults just come natural. Well, I'm fine. Do you even know what you're looking for? Yeah, broken shingles, loose flashing. Loose flashing? How do you even know that? Is it weird that I know things? Not weird. Just surprising. Yeah. One day you're going to own a house, you're going to need to learn this stuff, too. No. I'm going to make enough money to where I can pay somebody else to do it. I'd love to see that. Oh, now you're making fun of me. Uh, no, I mean it. Because i got a plan. I'm going to be rich. Yeah, what's your plan? To be rich. Yeah, I'll give you one thing. You got confidence. Thank you. You get a second thing, you'll be unstoppable. <laughs> Sounds like I'm halfway there. I suppose you are. Missy? Yeah? Missy? What? Missy. What? Are you nervous about moving to a new city? Nope. But you won't know anyone. That's the best part. I won't be the dumb sister of the smartest boy in town. You're not going to brag about me? Hell no. I'm going to tell people you were sent away to a school for special kids. Caltech is a school for special kids. Great. It works on two levels. Are you nervous? Yes. What if no one likes me in California? No one likes you here. No one understands me here. There's a difference. Well, I'm sure there'll be a bunch of smart other weirdos at Caltech. Caltech? Like calculators? Like California. Oh, I like mine better. Well, I'm sure you'll make lots of friends. Maybe even a smart weird girlfriend. I have a girlfriend. Her name is Science. Cool. When do you leave? I'm guessing you don't have classes today? How'd you know? Because you're dressed like a six-year-old. Don't say that. He looks fun. Thank you. Don't forget, we have the family portrait today. Do we really have to stand in a field of flowers? Yes. If you're worried about getting stung, I have a backup beekeeper uniform. You are not wearing a beekeeper uniform in the picture. Please, it'll really help my story about him going to a special school. What's happening? <sighs> We are leaving for the blue bonnet picture at four. Don't be late. You wouldn't miss it. Hey, you want to ride to school? No, I'll take the bus. Suit yourself. See y'all later. Four o'clock. If I get stung by a bee, I'm turning you into Child Protective Services. <laughs> what am I smelling? I'm wearing peppermint oil. It's a natural bee repellent. You smell like a candy cane. Do not lick me. <laughs> hey, uh, speaking of smells, do I have time to change Cece? Still waiting on George. Go ahead. Okay. You need some help? No. Oh, well, I am an all-white. Yes. What's going on? Mary, we got some bad news. Where's George? I'm so sorry. He, uh, he had a heart attack. He's okay, right? He's gone. Thank <laughs> you.